Hi, we're going to talk today about how to use the verb do using the lesson in the fundamental textbook on page 30. So the verb do has two forms, do and does. Do with I, you, we, and they. And does is with the personal pronouns he, she, or it. Many questions will start with do or does. Do, does, do, does. Now remember, does is used with he, she, or it. So that's why we only see it here. You, they, we, I, all use do. Do you like Los Angeles? Yes, I do. Does it feel like home? No, it does not. Do you have friends yet? Yes, I do. Do they help you? Yes, they do. So when you answer, use the same verb that starts the question. Do you? Yes, I do. Does it? No, it doesn't. Say the subject first and then the verb. Let's take a look at the personal pronouns again. So remember, last time we talked about it, there's singular and plural, just one, more than one. I, you, he, she, it, talking about one person or thing. We, you, they, more than one thing. So if we look at the plural, we do, you do, they do. And we look at the singular, I do, you do. But this last one, what is the one we use for this one? He, she, it, does. That's right. So remember with these five, we use do. But with third person singular, we use does. So now we've got some problems that I'd like you to work on with a friend. So call a friend, do a video chat with a friend, but work on these 10 problems with somebody else. For these first five, what you need to do is put these three sections in the right order. And be strategic, be smart about it, because you know that capital letters are going to be at the start of a sentence. And what are you going to find at the end of a sentence? That's right, punctuation. And because these are all questions, you're going to find question marks in each of these. So put these sections in the order. Here, which form of do or does goes into that blank? So, your city, is it going to use do or does? Is it plural? Is it an it or is it a you or an I? You need to think about these things. So talk it over with a friend and then write it down in your notebook or journal. You can always check back through the lesson to help you figure it out. Good luck. Bye.